Very warm welcome to you all. Um, my name is David James. I'm Dean of Academic Development here at the University of Gloucestershire. Um, and I've got a brief leading on learning and teaching and research and work really closely with Richard and our learning technologists um, in terms of some of the uh, educational technology developments that we are pushing on here. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you to our um, fantastic new business school building. So we are the uh, beneficiaries of a fantastic new development on this campus and I really hope you have a great day and enjoy the facilities and space we have to offer. Um, a really uh, big thank you to Catalyst for providing support for the day. Uh, we're really uh, grateful for that um, and really uh, happy that you can share um, the uh, environment with us throughout the course of the day. Um, it very much um, came to my attention while I was uh, having a coffee earlier, um, what a small community and world this is. Uh, the networks and interconnections are really fascinating. Um, and it did make me smile and it made me very proud actually when I realised, Don, you're a graduate of uh, this campus, which looked um, very different, I think, in the mid-1980s. Um, so uh, welcome back, Don. Um, it looks like you have a really exciting program, um, and uh, I think uh, there are a number of presentations on the list that I'd very much uh, like to see, and I will be looking back at the videos from the day. Um, I think Richard was set, suggesting to me, you didn't want to hear about what we've been up to here, but I really, I think Richard's being a bit modest, actually. Um, when um, I took over this role four years ago, um, I think it's fair to say here at University of Gloucester, we, we were really lagging in terms of um, the way we were using technology for learning. And we've had a multi-year programme to really develop things here. Um, and that's really given us some advantages, actually, learning from others, looking at what best practice is. Um, and probably the benefit also is we weren't dealing with lots of legacy systems. Um, our biggest um, challenge, actually, underpinning this was actually getting our data sorted out. Um, I don't know how familiar that is to um, some of you in your own institutions, uh, because we were really going to use the data um, in terms of the technology that we were providing. Um, and we've made some really good progress. Um, I draw attention particularly to the fact that we've done an integration across from Moodle to our uh, student record system. Uh, we use uh, Moodle for assessment, um, and that's a really important feature of what we do. That's the only bit of the development over the last three years that's actually kept me awake at night, moving to that for the start of the 18-19 academic year. And very much thanks to Richard and all the preparatory work that our technologists did, that went really smoothly. Um, I, I know if there's one thing we don't want to mess up on, it's assessment. So uh, it was absolutely critical. But also putting around um, Moodle some of our other systems, including Mahara, and making sure the integrations are really good. Um, and the students really feed back to us that what we've got in place now is really good. And very importantly also, the academic staff, who are absolutely vital to the way these things are implemented, really giving us lovely feedback now about how we're really getting them using their time for the things that only they can do, and we're making everything else as, as easy as possible. So um, you can probably guess I'm very proud of uh, the team here and our learning technologists are around today if you want to ask them any questions about that. So I hope you have a fantastic day, enjoy the new facilities and at this point I'm going to hand over to Richard. Thank you.